please say hi to Carla. Remember Kelvin? Carla is Kelvin's cousin. Like Kelvin, she's very interested in understanding math. One day she wondered, could the numbers 5, 5, and 10 be a fact family? Carla knows that a fact family triangle is a big help for listing facts. A fact family is made up of three numbers that go together to make addition and subtraction facts. You put the largest number at the top of the triangle, and the other numbers go to the bottom. Let's use the numbers 3, 3, and 6. These three numbers are an example of a fact family. So 6 goes to the top, and both 3's go to the bottom. When you start at the bottom, go over and up. You get addition facts, like this. 3 plus 3 equals 6. 3 plus 3 equals 6. We can see that both addition facts are the same, so we will only list it once. 3 plus 3 equals 6. And when you start at the top, go down and over, you get subtraction facts. 6 minus 3 equals 3. 6 minus 3 equals 3. Again, both subtraction facts are the same, so we will only list it once. Well, Carla was all set. She started with a blank triangle and had her numbers ready to go. Today, she'll use the numbers 5, 5, and 10 to start listing addition and subtraction facts. She decided to do addition first. Start at the bottom, go over and up. 5 plus 5 equals 10. She started at the other side and did the same thing. 5 plus 5 equals 10. Since both facts are the same, we will only list it once. Next, she tries subtraction. Start at the top, go down and over. 10 minus 5 equals 5. And go down the other way. 10 minus 5 equals 5. Again, both are the same, so we only list one. Carla really understood her addition and subtraction facts. Let's review what Carla figured out. A fact family is a group of numbers that go together to make addition and subtraction number sentences. A fact family triangle helps us to find these number sentences. And with the family 5, 5, 10, we get two number sentences. 5 plus 5 equals 10, and 10 minus 5 equals 5. Thanks for all your help, Carla. And so there we have it. Teachers, parents, and homework helpers, if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to like and subscribe. If you think someone else might find this useful, feel free to share. And if you have any comments or suggestions for future topics, my email is in the description below. Thank you for being here. It's always great to see you. Take care and remember, it never hurts to be nice.